Well guys, thank you for the 100 subscribers. This is my gaming setup. Ignore half the room because unfortunately it's in my bedroom and I don't have much space. So let's go to this side here first. So obviously you got the first thing, which is the lamp, which I use at night. Oh, you forgot how bright it was. <laughs> then I got my DS, 3DS, which is fully jailbroken. I shouldn't be telling you that, but I'm telling you guys because it's a secret. Then I got my chargers here. Got my Galaxy Live Buds. Got a rechargeable chargers for when I use my Xbox controller when I play my Xbox, which has been like three months. <laughs> so anyways, that's the, that important part covered. Let's go to this side here. This is the main desk. <laughs> So first we'll go on the table and show you the main part on the table. Okay guys, uh, ignore the shadow, I'm sorry because I don't have proper light down here, it's hard to put a phone light in. Uh, we got the computer, which is what I use for editing, for gaming. And everything. I don't use it for gaming, I usually use it for editing and streaming. Specs will be in the description. Then we got the PS5 here, which is matte black, as you can see, I like having it black instead of white. I don't like it in white because white gets dust on it and you know, you can see all the marks. Even though you can see the marks on the black as well, but I just prefer the black. Obviously it comes with the base model, 825 gig. I could a 532 terabyte, I'll put that in. And I also got a 4 terabyte external hard drive, which is around the back for our PS4 games. Then I've also got this here, which is the Elgato Party chat link, which I use to talk to my friends. And obviously you guys can hear the audio. Then I got my Xbox Series X, which I haven't played in like two months, because I've been busy playing PS5. I uh, got the hard drive on top of here, which is for the Xbox One games. I got that for Game Pass basically, because obviously, you know, Xbox is buying everybody. So I have to have Game Pass because that's like the new thing now. That's the thing that's trending in it, so I'm gonna have Game Pass. Underneath here though, is the Elite Series 2 controller. I had to buy it because, you know, it was on sale. I bought it for 80 pounds and I had vouchers on top of that. So let's obviously open the controller, show you guys the controller this is obviously the case wow look at that it just feels so nice and i like it because you can take the unlock sticks off i don't have nothing to do with anything at all but it just feels cool then you got the padlocks the back of the padlocks that's the flipping what you use to lock the rooms <laughs> And it's just a nice controller, you contain the tension, it feels so nice. But I keep it away because obviously I don't like touching it. <laughs> I bought it but I don't like playing with it basically, that's what I'm trying to say. Got the Xbox headset in there, I got this as a gift. So that's it for underneath the desk. I don't think I missed anything else, have I? So okay. one, one last thing I forgot to show you guys before I went, is this plug here. It's not plugged in but it's basically my LED lights. I've got LED strips around the desk, which I will show you guys in the cool cinematic. I sit on the desk and everything happens here. So let's start with the left hand side first. This is my uh, control, my remote, sorry, for the monitor. I can turn the monitor off. That's actually kind of cool. Now I bought this monitor and I realized it has a remote with it. I've never seen a monitor with a remote before. Then we got this here, which is a Rode PSA one. Got my Blue Yeti boom arm thing, whatever it's called to stop the shock waves. Does that make any sense? No, it doesn't. <laughs> then I got my PS5 headset. I use for playing play PS5. When I'm playing on my own, I use this by the way. But when I'm recording, obviously I use the, I use the headset for audio when I'm playing. I've also got the HyperX Cloud Stingers downstairs. Yeah, I've got, I don't know why I've got four headsets. We got my monitor, which is the BenQ EX2780Q, 1440p, 144 hertz. I use this for my main computer screen. I just use this everything loaded obviously you guys like you know your boys on 111 subscribers in it so you know support man in it and start telling your friends because it's not like that part of the video <laughs> Then underneath it we got the Asus ROG Strikes I forgot the model number of the keyboard <laughs> <laughs> Okay I don't have it can you see there in the box the Asus ROG Strikes Scope RX Research 100. <laughs> I got it because it's got RGBs and it's just like... One thing I forgot, sorry, I know I'm just going all around the mall. I got a Logitech C920. After that, we've got my Stream Deck, which I bought for when I stream. You know, Stream Labs, Record, OBS. I, I don't stream anymore. It's not because I'm stopping streaming forever. I'm just focusing on my YouTube channel. So let's focus on one thing first. And then hopefully uh, we'll plug in the Twitch later and we do Twitch as well. Then I got my Nintendo Switch. Which is not the OLED one, it's the regular one, which I bought this a long time ago. You know, got some games on there and stuff. Got a load of games for Nintendo Switch. I play on it now and then. I've got my games here for the Nintendo Switch. I've got them all in like this fancy case. Mario Kart, Smash Bros, all these games. I've got all the Pokemon games on. Yeah, I like collecting games, basically. That's why I got them. Uh, let's go Eevee's basically because my cousin borrowed in it. And then uh, I got Crash Bandicoot, which goes there. My brother's borrowing that. This here is the USB stick, which I plug into the PS5 to use my PS5 headset. I got this uh, ROG. I can't read the name. 
Rogue Gladius 2 Origin Optical Gaming Mouse. I got this because it's a rug and I like Asus Republic of Gamers because the RGBs are literally bought it. I got the mouse mount with the Baltius QI. Check this out. This is actually sick. Uh, these boards here, which I haven't used in a long time because they don't work anymore, but I don't know why it's still gone. So as you guys can see, can you see that QI in that corner? It's literally wireless charging. So what I do is when I put that on, look, it's charging. Can you see the red light? It's literally charging my uh, Galaxy Buds. Enough of me trying to charge my Galaxy Buds. We got the PlayStation Media Remote, which I've used like once. Like I said, I have not used it once. I've used it quite a few times. It's nice and handy. It's not working because I took the batteries out. What happened with it was actually I had it plugged in, not plugged in, sorry, I had the batteries in. And when I used to touch my desk, somehow this used to come on. And my PS5 used to come on. I'm like, yo, I thought some gin was living in my house and some ghost. But fuck that shit, I'm out. So I took out the batteries. Second monitor, which I use for gaming, is also connected to my PC. Uh, this is the Mobius, Mobius, because it's got a Z at the end, EX2710. I did an unboxing on my channel, Horizon Forbidden West, Dying Light 2, Black Ops, Cold War, Vanguard. But anyways, enough of that. 1080p, 144 hertz, perfect for gaming. Unfortunately, PS5 doesn't spot 1440p, so I couldn't get that. Then I got my PS5 controller, Dual Sense one. I've also got the red one and the white one, which is under my bed. I'm trying to collect them all, but I want to get the purple next, because the purple looks kind of nice. But I think I'll do that later when I'm trying to sort my room out. My Series X controller, which feels nice. It does feel nice, so be honest with you. The grip on this is a lot better than the PS5 one. This feels nice, but obviously this has got the haptic feedback and adaptive triggers. My Nintendo Switch Pro controller, I used to use this in bed, you know. I plug it, I put my Switch on next to my bed and start using this. The back here, which is gonna be a bit hard to get, HDMI switch, so I've got the PS5 on two, Xbox on one, and the Switch on three. I've got this thing here, which is a HDMI extender. What that is, is uh, that's plugged into my Elgato 4K60 Pro, which is in my PC. And the final thing here is my USB extender, which I have plugged in, but I don't know what I use it. I don't know. I don't know what that thing is. I just got that plugged in and I don't I actually don't know what it is. I think that's even my game is helping. Oh, cost me about $8,000. But anyways, guys. Oh, thank you for that. I forgot. <laughs> my chair, sorry. My chair is the GL Conferni. Funny thing is I paid £60 for this before like the COVID whole stuff kicked off, right? And my mom was cursing. She like, what, you, why do you buy a chair for? You got no space. This is when I was in the other room and there was literally no space. I didn't even use it for a month because there's no space. I just had it there stuck in the corner. But then luckily I bought it because after the COVID all that stuff happened, the chair went to 160. I saved 100 pounds. But one last thing I forgot to show you is my laptop. Don't know why I'm just uh, so excited to do the video for you guys. So it's in a Lenovo bag, but guess what brand it is a laptop. As if I didn't make it obvious enough already. You probably forgot that, huh? Republic of Gamers. I literally just love Republic of Gamers me. So this is a standard laptop, nothing serious. Okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's actually my brother's laptop. But I'm borrowing it because when I go out and about, I edit. When I go to his shop and I help him, uh, I edit. He attempt to help him, but I actually do edit. Got an i5 10th gen, and he's got a GTX 1650. So anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoy my game itself. And thank you for the 100 subscribers. Next milestone is 200 subscribers. I know we can hit it, then we can go for 1,000. When you get to 1,000, we'll do a giveaway. I don't know how to tell what the giveaway. It might be something like a PS5. It might be five pound voucher for Argos. Don't know yet, but uh, we'll decide when we get there. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like, smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time.